to create a Collaborate session, you can go to Collaborate on your course menu if you have added a link to the Scheduling Manager, or through the Control Panel, go to Course Tools, and under Blackboard Collaborate, it'll bring you to the same thing. To create a session, just simply click on Create Session, and you can give it a name, a suitable name, so I'm going to call it a Practice uh, session and I'm just going to use the default times here or if I want I can just simply change so I'm going to actually set it to start at 11 and to finish at 12. Click done and we can allow entry into the session before so that students can just check that they can get into the uh, session and we can also share with other student courses. So by default, students within your Blackboard course will be able to access the Collaborate session, but we could actually add other courses if we wished. And there's a number of different other options here, including that you can add preloaded content. So if you have taken a PowerPoint file and converted it into a whiteboard, or you have some multimedia video or something else that you want to upload, you can attach it so that when the session is open, it will automatically be added. You can add a grade column, which just allows you to record who visits or who watches the session. And you can add other moderators, so other people who are in the course have access uh, as a moderation role when they go into the Blackboard session or the Blackboard Collaborate session. Just then simply hit save, and Blackboard will create the session, and we'll see it here that we have our practice session, and it's available at this time. We can go and edit it if we need to, and we can also add a link. So if we want to add a link to any of our content areas, so if we want to put, say, in module resources, a link to this practice session, we can then hit save. And when you go into the module resources, you'll see that you have a link directly to the Thursday practice session. It will also, by default, be added to the Collaborate session. So if you have Collaborate uh, available for students, they'll be able to see it here. Again, if we go into the student preview, we can see exactly what a student would see. If they go into the Collaborate session, you can, they'll be able to see any sessions that are available, plus any recordings. And as we have also added the link in module resources, they can add it here. So it's up to you to decide which is the easiest way to work with your students. Okay, that's it.